So um, we always heard of energy efficiency, sustainable, but we don't know what is that. So everybody can contribute to energy efficiency in their daily routines. So what is energy efficiency? It's a way to manage and restraining the growth in energy consumption. But in layman language, in order for us to understand in an easier way, we could say that use less energy to provide the same services. So um, everybody can save the planet in their daily routines. For example, we use washing machine, we could always use the um, five-star energy rating washing machine, save water, save electric bill, and instead of on the aircon, we could always on the fan instead of aircon. And if you really need to on the aircon, maybe you can choose those inverter types of aircon which would save energy, um, electricity bill. And car, we can go for hybrid car, use less petrol. This is also one of the way for energy efficiency. And as all of us know, industrial consumer use the largest energy in Malaysia and, and I think in worldwide is also the same. So they contribute a bit on um, a lot of those heat waste. So they can help also to reduce and reuse the heat waste. And in building design, if let's say we have a land, we want to we want to build a house, we could always design the house facing south with a large window so that it can capture daylight. Okay? And then we can also plant the tree to reduce the heat coming through the house. Okay, so this is also some of the way to, um, to provide energy efficiency in design a house. And in Malaysia, we don't talk about other countries, we talk about Malaysia. The typical way for energy efficiency is maybe to use a well-insulated roofing system or even photovoltaic. Photovoltaic is um, still not so popular because of the cost, but it started to gain cautious from the, from the power plate. And of course, LED light is also one of the very common, co common way to, um, for energy efficiency. So sustainable roofing system. Sustainable means it can last longer and keep the maintenance cost over the years, low at over the years, and of course, deliver proven performance by reducing heat and also cost saving. So um, there's many ways to make our house green, not only from roof, but also from maybe gardening or recycled water, insulation, appliances like the electrical appliances that I have mentioned just now. But today we are not go going to cover all, we only cover roof, okay? Sustainable roofing system, we only cover roof. So, one of a very popular um, roofing system that we talk about is green roof system. So, green roof system, anybody know how to make a green roof system? A lot still don't know because it involves many layers. They have this um, slab, primer, asphalt, insulation, there's too many layers and the cost also very, very high. So Malaysia is still at a very initial stage to implement green roof system. But some of the prestigious developer already started to practice green roof system, not massively, but in a small scale. Okay? So some of the examples in overseas, overseas, especially Western country, they are very actively in, involved in this green roofing system. So this is Vancouver Convention Center, Singapore, our neighboring country. They have Ang Mokyo's flat, also started to um, have this green roof system. Some of the shopping mall in the town, and this is one of the flat called Pungo, Pungo, P-U-N-G-G-O-L, Pungo flat. And in Western country, some of the residential houses, bus stop, and in the garden outside um, this conventional hall, also we can see a, a, a small green roof. Okay, so okay, how the heat transfer into the house is actually through radiation, conduction, and convection. In order to understand more easier, okay, you can see that the heat from the sun heat up the roof tiles, and the heat will travel through the roof tile into your attic space, and further go into your ceiling board and to the plaster ceiling and into the living hall. 
So how to create an energy efficiency and sustainable roofing system? There's many ways in Malaysia. Cislation, foil, rock wool, there's many ways. But today, we are going to talk about cellulose insulation. Why we call it cellulose insulation? Because the material is made of cellulose, fiber, resin, and bitumen. But um, I'm from Lien Giap, so this material, we call it isolin under the roofing system. But it's made of cellulose fiber with bitumen. Okay? So this cellulose fiber, we also call it isolin. Huh? can see that it is made of cellulose fiber, bitumen, and resin. It's a um, bitumen base. And the shape is corrugation, corrugated type. The thickness is 3 mm. So the height of the corrugation is 38 mm. That's why it allows minimum pitch application 5 degree. As long as the roof pitch is 5 degree, then you can use this system, cellulose insulation. The product dimension, okay. the size, 2 meter, 0 0.95 meter. In order for you to understand more easier, you can see a size of the door, 2 meter by 0 0.95. Okay. So the thickness is 3 mm and the depth of the corrugation is 38. Okay. Fixing guard, minimum pitch allowed is 5 degree. So if let's say your roof design, you have a modern design which only 5 degree, then you can apply this system and on top you can use whatever types of tiles. So by having this system, the right one is with the isolin under roofing system, the left one is without. With the isolin under roofing system, when the heat transfer into the house, allow the fresh air to go in and push up the hot air. So this is how it makes your living area more comfortable. So the advantages using isolin under roofing system. This is a green product because it does not contain any asbestos. It's free from asbestos. And that is why our product also in um, standard specification 2014 by JKR, by Jabatan um, Kejaraya Malaysia. So our product is green, asbestos free, and it's high insulation, good insulation and sound absorbency. Easy to transport because it's very light. One piece, measure 2 meter by 0 0.95, is only 6 kg. And in meter square, it's only 3.4 kg. So it's e easy to tran transfer to those isolated areas, for example, an isolated island or inside the jungle. That's why we also do um, many projects like Felda, uh, for further inside the jungle. And we provide 10 years warranty against water leak. Okay? And this is lightweight. Environmental friendly, which is acknowledged by MGBC, Malaysia Green Building Confederation. And is listed in Green Pages Malaysia. So using this system is eligible to claim under EE energy efficiency and MR material and resources. So isolin under roofing system can apply for low pitch roof and also pitch roof. Low pitch roof as low as five degree pitch roof. Maximum 90 degree. So this is how the system works. Normally, after the first baton, we ha um, after the thrust, we have baton, and then after the baton, we straight go to the finishing tiles. That is how the teeth come into the house because by dismantling the tiles, they can easily come in from the rooftop. But by having this system, isolin under roofing system. If so happen, the thief come in, they take out the tiles, they see your roof also, they don't know how to dismantle. It, it takes time for them to take out my roof. So this is also one of the advantages, security against break-in. Okay? So by having this system, it creates better ventilation because there's a gap between my roof and the finishing tiles. So it can make your tiles can last longer. This is why keep the maintenance cost low over the years. So, okay, our isolin under roofing system is a waterproofing. So, not only, um, I mean, um, reduce heat, reduce noise, but it also acts as a secondary roof. So, it's a weatherproof secondary under roof. It improves ventilation and it prolongs the lifespan of the roof tile 
ของ c r i c k t o w s แกล t o w s Metal Roof Improve Thermal and Acoustic So even outside raining also you might not know because it's not noisy So it's a lightweight under roofing system and easy to install Any contractor will know how to install it as long as they read through the spec okay. And of course security against breaking Not easy for the theft to come in So you see that if let's say your tiles break, the water will not go into the ceiling. It will drain out from my roof. Car the current uh, market trend is when the developer handovers and the purchaser has 18 months to make the claim to check whether is there any defect. And most of the complaint received from the developer from the architect is leaking. Leaking everywhere. So by having this system, it actually reduces the headache of the developer, of the contractor, of the architects. Okay. As I mentioned just now, not easy for them to go into the house. They have to take out the tiles, take out the second baton, take out my roof, only then they can go in. By the time they take out the tiles, the owner already wake up. So this one actually um, is a good reason. Uh. That's why many developers started to implement this system not only for the security but also water leaking and also of course um, thermal insulation so some of the project that we have done over the years this system is not new in the market the first project we did in 92 and until today is still there later we will have some photo to show you so um, this housing project is in central region in Ipoh 48 units of Samidi, 24 units of Banglo, all at low pitch. So low pitch normally, you only have one option, metal roof. But with isolin under roofing system, it gives more option to the architects and developers to choose the material to use. And for this case, they are using um, concrete tiles as a finishing tiles. And you know that these types of degree for concrete tiles or clay tiles, definitely it will create big backflow. But with isolin, the water will drain out from my roof. This is also in central region Ipoh. They are selling at 400,000, but they give you isolin under roofing system. But if now we want to buy, also no chance already. Because phase two haven't start construction already sell off. 400,000 link house, but with isolin under roofing system is very worth to buy lah. but finish cannot get ready this one in Pulau Pinang and this is by one of the prestigious um, developer in KL also they have housing project using this system in Sandakan also they have okay so you can see that it's all low pitch with concrete tiles Water will definitely backflow from here and it will not go into the ceiling, it drain out from my roof. So this one can keep the maintenance cost low over the years. And at the same time, um, better comfort level to the purchaser. In Johor, in Johor, it's already more than five years. And this one also in Sandakan. Even metal roof. Uh, this is also one of the very famous developer in KL. Uh, normally, metal roof they will use um, insulation like foil or rock wool. Foil or rock wool also can give you energy efficiency, but just that the sustainability, how long it can last? 10 years, 15 years, 20 years? Uh, so, um, on the isolin under roofing system actually um, sustain longer than other option. This is pitch roof. Just now what I've shown is all low pitch roof, but this is pitch roof by one of the also developer in KL, very famous one. Their resort all one night more than ten thousand. Not all resort lah. Some in like Pangkola Resort in Sabah, they rented out one night more than 10,000. So why they go for isolin under roofing system is because of the finishing tiles that they choose is Belian shingles. So now Belian over the years, it was shrinkage. 
and that's why the water will seep in. So by having this system, even the water seep in also doesn't matter because it will not go into the ceiling. This is the latest project in Penang. It's a resort, it's a hotel. It's a hotel, high-end hotel. They are using Peranakan 8. Peranakan 8 also requires a very pitch roof. Not in order not to cause leaking. That's why they have another layer. The completed one is the block A and this is block B. Block 3 is coming up. Samdabi's project in Bukit Jelutong. Also using Belian shingles. Anybody knows who is the owner of the house? Our ex prize minister, Dr. Mahadeo's birthplace in Alostar. Anybody from Alostar? No, uh? okay, so this is the birthplace of our Dr. M. And they installed isolin under roofing since 94. 20 years already, no leaking. And it's still there. I checked before I put this photo up. It's still there. You can see from outside. Okay. Because it's using ATAP. No, ATAP, the lifespan is not long. Maybe four years, three years, you need to change already. So by having isolin under roofing system underneath, you can change it anytime. Was not cause hassle. Makama Selayang, huh? since 97. Istana Alam Shah, in Klang, since 99. And they want Undangan Negeri Melaka. Okay. Camp Mersing. This camp, the roof area is more than 1 million square foot. And all using isolin under roofing system. So, um, how isolin provide energy efficiency and also sustainable is because it provides cost saving by minimizing the maintenance cost over the years by eliminating the um, leaking problem and of course energy efficiency reduce the indoor temperature and provide better comfort level so you no need to on aircon all the time because we nowadays I think most of us have the habit to on the aircon during daytime but with isolin under roofing system it can minimize your electric bill so um, this system is also acknowledged by MGBC